Hey guys, welcome to episode 8 of ZTI's Friday Night Fights. This week, I, I decided to play some Street Fighter X Tekken, which, if you can tell, I haven't played for a while, or much at all for that matter. I haven't really decided a main team for this game yet, but I've been trying to stick to Kami and Hirong. But I've been having problems with strong zoning characters, or people with fireballs in general. But, I look... Uh, Justin Long released a tier list for this game recently, and apparently both my characters are super S tier, so I should be doing better. Um, I want to try and learn other characters like Jury, Poison, and Alyssa, so I can actually have some zoning, but I'm not too great with them. I, I tried, but it hasn't really worked out. Uh, I know there's not too much hype for this game right now, but I, just, I felt I needed something different to play for this video, so enjoy. Alright, the best news I read this week so far is that apparently Ayuno posted on his blog that they're... He posted about he's working on Ultra Street Fighter 4, he's wor they're working really hard to balance the new cast, which is great. But he also posted that next week they're gonna show off that. He never said what that is, and it's not 100%, but it's most likely that he's talking about showing off the new fifth character. Which I'm really excited about this, and I can't wait to hear who it is. Uh, I personally would think it would be funny or awesome to have like Violent Ken or one of the two generic people fighting in the old Street Fighter 2 arcade machines at the beginning. I don't know, I think that would be pretty cool. Not seriously, I hope it's something better than that, but, you know, little what I'm hoping for. So... I don't know if anybody was watching, the, how many people at least were watching the Microsoft Studio stream where they played some King Killer Instinct and they answered some questions for everybody. But if you did, you were probably able to see the newest character for the game in like the funniest way possible. Now if you don't know what happened, apparently they were playing some random games and one of the people playing was uh, picking characters and he selected random select. But when they loaded up the characters in the stage, it was apparently a new character. Uh, so, yeah, they weren't pr they weren't probably planning on that. It was Orchid, by the way, and she wasn't announced yet. So they had to shut down the stream as soon as possible. Like you see, one of them just nope, stick down, unplug, and they were done. So it's safe to say that somebody got in trouble for that. But hopefully they don't stop the stream because I actually enjoyed watching it a bit. Because I've kind of gotten interested in this game. I'm going to definitely try it out at least when the Xbox One comes out. And I'm probably going to pick the, st the spider chick. She looks pretty interesting. Uh, that's pretty much it. There wasn't that much other things that happened this week. Um... Next week, we're going to try something a little different. Why everybody, uh, A few people like Classic Komodo is going to play the demo of Project M. Since they released some good, cool character tra trailers and combos. And I think it looks amazing. Like Mewtwo's instant teleport or Roy's and pre better special moves. I, I want to learn these combos. At least try my hardest to pull them, pull them off in a real game. We would have did it this week, but we couldn't find any controllers, so hopefully we'll have that sorted out by next week, so that's something to look forward to. Uh, remember to subscribe, like, leave a comment, and as always, stay classy. It's all or nothing.
逆らっちゃいけないわ。